Imagine you're sitting at a bar. A bar long ago, somewhere in the late 1800s. Not just any bar. Even by the standards of that time, this bar was already aged by 100, 200 years. Wooden bar, the booths are wooden. The lighting, there's no electricity. It's gas lanterns and they're flickering. Over here, you hear somebody laughing. Over here, someone singing. There's a lot of joy going on in this bar. You've had your share for the night. It's raining outside. You want to go home. You don't want to go out the front door because, well, it's closer to go through the alley. So you head towards the back door. As you turn, there's a man in the back, near the back door. And he's looking at you. He's rolling something on the table, picking it up, rolling it again, picking it up, rolling it again. You're walking that direction. You can't make out exactly what he has. You can see this bag on the table next to him. He has a top hat on the table. He has a cape on, black on the outside, red on the inside. He has a cane propped up against the booth. As you head towards the door, you get closer and you realize he has a single six-sided die. He's picking it up, he's dropping it, it rolls. He looks at the die, he looks at you. Does it again, over and over. The light flashes across his eyes. And in that moment, you see some mystery, maybe a little bit of mischievousness, and just a hint of danger. But you're intrigued. He's smiling. You walk over. He picks the dial. Would you hold your hand up here, please? He sets the die on your hand. He invites you to roll it, so hold it up high. In a moment, you're going to roll the die, and as you do, it's going to go into slow motion. So roll the die. You can see the top of that die. It only has six numbers on it. One, two, three, four, five, or six. What number did you roll? Five. Five. He looks at you. He smiles. He looks at the die with a five on it. He reaches into the bag. And he takes out some cards. You rolled a five. This is your five. Not the two, not the three. Six. One of the four. You rolled the five. He slides the card over to you. He smiles at you. Turns the card over and it says, be nice. <laughs> now you're just lifted up by this man. He's made you happy. So you extend your hand out as a lady would. He kisses your hand, bids you good night. And you smile as you walk out. And as you walk out, he watches you and he smiles until the door closes. Then his smile goes away. His eyes go steely. He's not happy with you at all, baby. See, you rolled the five, the number that says, be nice. Because had you rolled any other number, you'd have been the next victim of a man they called Jack the Ripper. Oh. <laughs>